In this video, we are going to solve a simple problem based on proportion. Let's look at our question. 40 machines can produce 2,400 identical balls in 5 hours. We are supposed to find out how many balls would 30 machines produce in 8 hours. So here we have three things, the number of balls, time, and machines. Let's see the relation between each one of them, starting with the number of balls produced and the number of machines used. If I increase the number of machines used, the production will also go up. And if I decrease the number of machines, the production of balls will also go down, which means that the balls produced is directly proportional to the number of machines used. Similarly, let's see the relation between the number of balls produced and the hours spent. If I increase the number of hours, the number of balls produced will increase. And if I decrease the number of hours, the production of balls will reduce. Which means, again, that the number of balls produced is directly proportional to the hours spent. This information can be written as B directly proportional to M times H, which is B equals K times M times H. Let's use the first information given to us to get the value of K. 2400 is the value of B given to us. K times M is 40 and H is 5 which means 2400 equals 200 times k. So dividing by 200 on both the sides, I get k as 12. Okay, so my equation is b equals 12 times mh. Now I have been given 30 machines and 8 hours and I need to find b for that. So 12 times 30 times 8 and that comes out to be 2880 balls so that's my answer uh, the number of balls produced by 30 machines in 8 hours thank you